Okay, here's another one for you. Uh, this one's kind of funny, but um, I, I built a house with the builder. Uh, this was way back when, and I uh, built the house next door. Uh, the people that um, were my next door neighbors had bought that house from me. And uh, they called me one day and they go, they go, yeah, we were, it, it, you know, we've been in for a month or so and we open the windows and we keep smelling like septic. Like there's, but the weird thing is it's not coming from the ground level or the basement, it's coming from the upper floor. And I'm like, well, that's really odd. So they had somebody come in and, uh, you know, out of warranty and check it out and, and uh, nothing. Um, so they couldn't figure it out. I guess within a couple of weeks, they told me, oh yeah, we found what the uh, source of the problem was. They opened the window and um, he was trying to trace the smell. And so they, uh, they would open and close windows upstairs in the bedrooms and stuff. And then there was one that just, they opened the window and it just smelled worse than the others. Um, so he uh, took the screen out and uh, he hopped out on the little you know roof ledge that was there. Lo and behold, he found a box. When he opened up the box, it was full of poo. <laughs> it was, it was, I guess the workers, the workers decided they were just gonna sh in a box. Instead of throwing it in the dumpster, they did their duty in there a few times, saved it up, boxed it, and put it on the roof. So that's my only guess, um, that maybe it was the workers that did it, but uh, anyways, kind of a funny story. Yeah. He was not laughing though. Catching me would be. <laughs> okay, um, so that's a good one.